I think the role of most leaders should be where it's with, within their purview. And if it gets big enough, the, the owner, CEO, I don't care who it is, go deal with the biggest problem that exists in your organization. That's your job. Go freaking talk to people. Talk to people. It really came down to a person going, talking to people, evaluating. Some problems you cannot, you can solve some issues with data, but data is more referential than explanatory. It is referencing something that's happening in reality, being you collected it well, whether it's, um, it's data around why people, when people get mentorship, or whether it's data around you know finances or how many patients are coming through, how many missed calls you have, is referential, it is not explanatory. You have to then add and go understand and interpret data to add an explanatory element to it. You could do the surveys and that, that can give you information and give you data, but a lot of times it's the actual personal experience required to understand why it's happening. I think a lot of times leaders aren't willing to do that. And so then they make decisions against data, but, but without going and understanding the data, without going and understanding the reason behind this outcome or these series of outcomes. For instance, are people missing calls? This is kind of your guys' world. Milad, this is also your world. Why are we missing calls? Why are we missing calls? Because the person at the front desk they have time because of their workload, so they don't get to the phone. You go, oh, we stop missing calls. I don't care how many times you say it. If their workload doesn't change, they're not going to stop missing calls. There's some point you have to go actually get why the data, what it's correlating to in reality. I think that is super important in how you solve grand systems problems. That's amazing. 